I was single and I had three children and my oldest son, he said, tell your boyfriend to give me some tennis shoes. I said, nigga, that's my boyfriend. Your daddy, <laughs> your daddy live around the corner. I said, your daddy live around the corner. Call your daddy and tell him to bring you some shoes. That's my, I'm trying to get me some shoes. But women don't do that. Okay, baby, I'll tell you. That's, that's, first of all, what my relationship is with whoever I bring around, that don't got nothing to do with you. You be a kid and mind your business. Let me regulate the shoes and all that. Give me $50. I ain't got it. What's happening, fam? LAR movement still moving. Subscriber die trying. You see the thumbnail, more importantly, you saw the clip. Now, you better watch these scamming ass kids. Uh, listen, you know, I'm not going to tell on myself. I just know people who've done stuff like this. Uh, <laughs> she, the, 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 the sister in the video, she knew it was up. When you make, when a mother makes that face that she made, like, I know you, they know they, they kid trying to get over. But sometimes, uh, sometimes say when a mother's dating a, a new boyfriend or whatever y'all be letting y'all kids get away with shit that be they be scamming and, and it might call and at some point it's gonna cause an issue like listen don't let these kids lie like they i don't, I don't get this and i don't get that putting on a sob story to these new people and these people trying to look out for them because they trying to just be nice sometimes and sometimes get in your good graces so they can get in your in your underwear right but these kids be doing the most getting you getting money out of you suckers you know clothes out of you suckers going going out to eat you know it, it was like back in the day you know get, that was the the getting ice cream and candy and getting you know and gifts that you wasn't supposed to get like think about it if you if you if your daddy say no and your mama say no and your grandparents say no then you know what i'm gonna get mama boyfriend he don't know about this he don't know i'm not supposed to have this so I'm gonna just I'm gonna pull it on thick. And, and mama find out like, oh, oh, that was oh, okay. You get he got you that that's okay. No, you gotta take that. You got mm -mm, mm -mm. but when the kids get so bold that they ask, they they ask, hey, why don't you get them to do that for me? You like, wait a minute, wait a minute, y'all. See, some of y'all mama's been hustling. Some of y'all been hustling. Y'all been scamming these dudes, you know. What is that? What is that old lie? You know, I got kids, but I don't need a man to take care of my kids. He got a daddy, but you nickel and dime asking this dude for shit that that's for you and your kids the whole damn time, but you don't need nobody. That bullshit. You know, why don't you get us some? You get some wings, get some pizza, and, and you you not thinking, you know, cause you know, twenty wings here two pizzas here and it's like wait a minute oh man we always wanted to go to this then you bring it you bring in these little rascals here and there and then it dawns on you wait a minute i'm she getting he that that kid father doing stuff and mama not doing stuff she just so i'm subsidizing this child support she getting off for free these kids getting off for free it's the hustle scamming ass kids from scamming ass families um sometimes you learn this with your family members you know try you know <laughs> kids staying up late at night eating all kind of junk food they ain't supposed to eat you know i remember because sometimes people go you know they want to be the fun person you know i'm, I'm gonna be the people the person that's cool and be the friendly person and yeah okay it's gonna be real fun when you get when you get used when they pimp you out <laughs> you know like i remember telling my aunt years ago don't let my son watch tv at night because he'll sit up at night to three in the morning watching tv and she's like he ain't gonna do that i'm looking i say hey 
don't let him sit don't let him make cut that tv off make sure he go to sleep because he'll be up all night and then don't don't give him i told him don't feed him at the you know a certain time he was a gremlin you know he get all hyper and whatnot he bouncing off the walls he went from he'll go from gizmo to the to the gremlin right she didn't want to listen she wake up at 2 30 in the morning he's sitting right in front of the tv and she gave him chocolate too oh yeah he he wide awake she like oh this is about to go bad you know but i've been around the block you know i remember i got a story about myself you know my dad said i i finessed his girlfriend and 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 then some sneakers he gave her a budget and i like oh no i think we should get them and he should get that and he said i finessed her out of a pair of shoes so i'm talking this out of personal experience you know he was mad i was in the i was in the shoes and by the way just for you kids just if you ever come across a video like this the stuff y'all won't be bad because i because because looking remembering what i asked for and what i got at that time there was some ugly ass shoes that i had to wear for a long time because i just you know because i was trying to finesse sometimes you finesse yourself into playing yourself but you got to remember that but the other thing is this and another thing the parents need to be in control of this the parent like the parents need to say hey listen these are my kids and this is the shit that they might pull don't fall for it but see if they but but it's hard to have that conversation because if you had that conversation with somebody that person gonna be like oh that's the that's what your kids are pull they your kids so oh, okay that's the shit you trying to pull with me so it's kind of like a catch-22 because you you want them to be aware of what the kids do and blind to what you do it's you know just a whole scamming thing you know so just saying you know sometimes in dating life people try to get over does it work yeah but does it cause relationships breakups yeah but i'm gonna leave it at that man i got stuff to do uh like share subscribe or die try and catch y'all on the next one peace all i ask is when you lay your head on that pill at night you know i gave you everything i had